We begin tonight in Iberia Parish, where a woman is dead after a spray of bullets hit her house. One of those bullets struck her while she was standing in the kitchen. News 10's Rodrika Taylor spoke with the grieving family today. Rodrika. Good evening, Mark. The family says it is tragic what happened to Anita Bob. They say she was an outgoing person. She was sweet and loved to cook and feed those around her. She said, Bobby, I'm shot. They shot me. And I said, I'm coming. These are the words George Bob III last remembered from his wife, Anita Bob. By the time I come up here, she was down on the floor. Gas before he says she was in the kitchen preparing a benefit dinner for her sister who recently passed away. She was in the kitchen cooking red beans for her sister benefit dinner. George filled with emotions of shock and disbelief. They didn't shot my wife. The family says the gunfire hit the home several times. It's devastating because one an innocent child could have got killed as well. They have an elderly man stay here. He could he sit on the recliner, you know, and bullets flew straight past him. He he could have gotten hurt as well. The family says this is not the first time their home was hit by bullets. They came uh, shot my house up before. But that was like a year. A year or something ago, you know. The family says gun violence in the area needs to stop. Stop the, the violence because there's innocent people out here. Innocent people getting killed. Don't know nothing what's going on. They killing the people for nothing. I think it's time that, you know, everybody come together. We just a little bitty town. Like, before you know it, everybody going to be dead if they keep killing each other. A message to anyone responsible for their loved one's death. Whoever did it to come forward because she was a well-known lady. She didn't have no enemies. You know, they, everybody loved Anita, known as Mice. Generate Police Chief Dusty Vallow says they don't know why the family home was shot multiple times, but it is an active investigation. The department is following up on several leads. Rodrigo Taylor, KLFY News 10.